Yes. Yes. When we walked out into that, in, deep, in Michigan, into that uh, silver dome, uh, and, you know, I mean, we were looking at it at mo- on monitors in the, in the dress rooms, obviously. And uh, when we walked out there, or oh, took the card out there, and we're actually in that ring, it, it was, uh, I don't know how to say it. You look, you look like a, you know, it, it was just so many people. And I said, where did they all come from? My God, what a successful uh, promotion this is, you know. And I'm, and we're part of it. And I said to Jim and Brad, I said, we're part of this. Can you believe it? They just laughed because, you know, and, but they were, you know, trying to be cool. But I think they were as excited as I was uh, to be a part of what was there. And the, the it was just, uh, the kids, as the kids would say, awesome. <laughs> awesome is the only word I can describe it. Yes. Very nice. Very nice. And and getting a win over uh, the Bulldogs and Tito Santana. I mean, those are three pretty damn good guys to get a win over. That's right. And uh, Tito, yes. Tito, to this day, I, I run into Tito sometimes at the, these uh, – Even I've even worked with Tito a couple of times in the past uh, few years. And, uh, yeah, when you run into these guys and, and uh, see them and uh, we talk about – WrestleMania 3 comes up a lot and uh, – to to get a win at WrestleMania three, I mean, who who can, <laughs> it just keeps going back to what I was saying. Who who, how can you believe that a street kid, you know, a few years ago was was a, a you know tearing up the streets in the cities, you know, trying to get by and trying to live and being a street fighter to make some money to you know to to eat and stuff like that and or finding a place to sleep is now in one of the biggest promotions in the history of wrestling and then getting a win to boot. So, I, you know, there's no descriptions. <laughs>